The boy, the boy, the boy, the boy, the boy do rag. Ooh, ooh, he's got a do rag. Ooh, ooh, he's with the shit and his lit. Oh, he's with the shit and his lit. Come on. Alright, let's go and action. What's up, peeps? It's your boy Joshua Kuhn, aka the boy with the visor, aka Giorgio Armani, aka your favorite YouTuber. And we're back with another video. So, um, basically, today, um, I thought since I started the Giorgio Armani series of the collection collection series what should I call it the collective how to dress anyway fat the fat the fashion advice tips are back and I thought since I made um, a shoe collection shoe um, well no since I've made a shoe essential slash showing my shoe collection slash giving you advice about trainers I thought I'd do the same but this time with jacket so as you can see and as you've been seeing um my backdrop has a lot of those wonderful pieces and um i thought it'd be nice to show you guys what i've actually got in detail what i've bought him what why i've bought him and um what i think are essential jackets and what you should be looking at that you guys should probably invest in for your all essential wardrobe you know what i mean there's different types of material when it comes to jacket different types you know denim corduroy velvet um silk polyester cotton and all that type of stuff so i'm not telling you guys to get a certain type of jacket but i'm just showing you the different types of jacket that you can get uh for the winter the fall the summer and all that type of stuff so without further ado let's get this video on the go so for this first section of the um, jacket collection of uh, Giorgio Armani slash Joshi Ken slash uh, your favorite YouTuber slash the boy advisor slash the boy the drag, um, we are going to talk about denim jackets. So. I believe they're all denim jackets. The reason why we're starting with denim jackets is because I think denim jackets are the ex the most essential jacket that you should start off if you want to start with a wardrobe. For me, like I said, I always use what I've been telling you guys so for my first fashion advice and tips video that Jojo Mani has told you. It made the collage. Plan what you want to wear. Wait. Plan what you think you're going to wear the item with and what you think you need in your wardrobe. So. I decided to go with your. I started. Well, I decided not to go with your typical um, blue, you know, basic denim jacket. Your basic. Yeah, I noticed. However, I do think that for people that are not are quite unsure about, you know, the fashion and the style, they should definitely go for the safest option and go for the classic. Your basic. Blue denim jacket, because I believe that it works with all year round. You can wear it during. Um, the spring and the summer, you know, with a light top. For people that are a bit more creative, you can, you know, add in your little twist. So I kind of DIY'd it and kind of ripped it. It was kind of like trendy back in the, well, back in the day, still now it's kind of trendy. So I kind of distressed it myself. And, uh, you know, just to add that little uniqueness to it. So this is like a little padded uh, denim jacket that I wear during the winter. And then for spring and summer vibes, you know, um, you can you can kind of go with your lighter uh, denim jacket still really thick material but um, you know no padding so you can wear it with a light top and stuff like that for the spring I went with the uh, solid green color just because it really liked the color green um, for the spring and the fall so that's why I kind of went for it and then for the summer I kind of went with this graffiti looking denim jacket you know so it's not quite boring it adds in like the color so you can go very plain with whatever 
whatever else you're wearing. So your top and your bottoms and your shoes can be plain and you can use this jacket as a statement. So that's something you guys can, you know, think about when you're buying um, your jacket when you're buying your jacket okay so next we're going to move on swiftly to another essential jacket that i think you guys should um think about getting if you don't already have it and that jacket is the bomber jacket but just like the denim jacket i believe that there's two different type of bomber jacket you can wear depending on the season whether it's spring summer or fall and winter um, so you've got a more lighter bomber jacket for the spring and summer that you can also that you know like the denim jacket you can wear with a light t-shirt so I went with this grey bomber jacket for the spring and winter to keep my outfits a bit more monochrome and uh, simple as you can see it's very thin still comes with like cuffs at the arms and the waist uh, to keep a nice little silhouette going on um, and little silhouette going on I hate the fact that I keep like talking I I talk like I'm not gonna end my sentence but I'm actually ending my sentence that really annoys me um, but anyway and then we've got this jacket which I didn't put on this play but this is another jacket that you should maybe consider for the spring and winter as you can tell it's got the same kind of material as those ones which I recommend more for like the fall and the winter however the lightness of it can you can with with the lightness of it you can kind of get away with wearing it for you know spring and summer and the burgundy color kind of you know brings out that little vibrance that you can wear during those sunny um season or when the, when the weather is kind of sunny so yeah that's something you can definitely think about um for my fall and winter i kind of went for two different like bright colors but again i used those two as like statement pieces so to keep my outfits very simple or very coordinated with what i'm wearing so for example if i want to go for like a little bit of like a brown and orange outfit i'd wear those ones but if i also want to go for like a completely like white or gray and black outfit i'll just wear this as like a statement so as you can tell it's very like shiny but it's very um heavy so it keeps you warm during those kind of like winty winty windy times um and then we have the classic um i think it's called like um ma1 i think ma1 bum bomber like the aviator like bomber jacket so those are like completely classic so i got these at um vintage um store so as you can tell it's got like the proper like reversible like vintage oversized kind of arms and um the very like cuffed buttons and the arms still so i'll kind of wear this during the winter because it kind of gives you that like super like i don't know what's the it kind of like eats you up and keeps you warm so i kind of like to wear it with the winter and you know the colder season um i still wear it with like a hoodie so like i kind of like double layer up sometimes with a jumper and still just to like keep that extra warmth in so yeah if that's something you guys want to think about all these jackets are in different colors just because i've got other jackets that are in black or in more like simple colors that i wear in my simple outfits but if you guys are really liking the bummer jacket look you should definitely start with basic colors like your black your grays and your white um but if you guys already have jackets that are in the monochrome type of color scheme then you should definitely do what i did and trying to get them in like a different more vibrant color and trying to work him around your outfits to make them maybe like statement pieces and stuff like that so yeah we're gonna move on now so yeah we're gonna move on now we're gonna move on to again a little bit of a smart vibe but with a twist so that's your blazer so now i think that blazers are coming well and swiftly into like the mainstream fashion trend i guess because you know blazers are basically known as like smart wear um so you can't really wear a blazer casually but as you can see this split blazer that i got from asos with the two different patterns kind of gives it like a modern vibe that you can definitely wear casually or smart um you know depending on your preference i do think that blazers are 
a jacket that you should definitely think about wearing during the spring and summer uh, just because in the fall and the winter it might not keep you as warm but you can definitely layer it up with like a jumper or a hoodie just to make sure that you know you keep yourself warm and stuff so yeah so for this next um, genre or type or this snake jacket that I want to show you guys um, it's very similar to the bummer jacket however it kind of like um, follows the vintage bummers and kind of like s switched it up. I don't really know if it's like it's a complete oh, actually it's a completely different jacket. Okay. The next jacket I want to introduce to you guys is the puffer jacket. Now the puffer jacket, as the name um, enticed, that is very puffy, <laughs> and uh, meaning that it's usually the jacket that you wear during the fall and the winter. You know, during them really cold season. Um, because it keeps like it really keeps all the warmth in, and um, you really don't want to wear that during the sunny weather because you're going to sweat to your life away. Man's not hot. Yo. Now um, this one is very similar to the very famous uh, North Face puffer jacket that is around like legit everywhere. Um, however, the puff that puffer jacket is very expensive and. Um, I'm not that type of guy right now, so I went with the, a more alternative to it, so this is like a camo style, um, camo was very in fashion like a couple years back, um, I mean it's still like in, you know, in trends, but you know, it's not as much as it was before, um, however, this jacket still keeps me just as warm, regardless of the pattern that it has, um, so a puffer jacket, like very similar to the North Face jacket, um, it's something that I would definitely recommend because um, it looks good and it keeps you um, super warm. So for this next puffer jacket, this is more in the lighter section. So this is probably a puffer jacket that I wear during like the fall or like when it's like very like lightly windy, not super cold and stuff. And um, it's black, so again, this is like a jacket that I wear when I've already got like quite a colorful or like quite a, clo a color blocked outfit, um, just so I don't, you know, um, do too much. So this kind of like keeps everything in and keeps everything, you know, centered around like the statement piece that I'm trying to um, that I'm trying to show off. And last but not least, this one is a super oversized puffer jacket. Now I love this jacket because it keeps me the warmest I've ever ever been in my life. It's a corduroy as well so that's something you guys can definitely look at. I definitely recommend it during the winter to keep you warm. Um, I went with the sandy brown color so I can you know match it with some of the outfits that I already have in my closet. Um, again I definitely recommend for you guys to go with a more like monochrome color so like that's your, your black and your grays however if you do want to get a brown one I definitely recommend it because it kind of matches the fall season as well as what's trending in the explore page on Instagram because a lot of influencers are going for that sand that sand and brown color scheme going on so that's definitely something that you guys should check out for the puffer jacket also it's very popular as you can tell it's very popular during um the winter season however there is other jackets that you guys can wear during the winter so you know try to mix it up because seeing the same puffer jacket every single winter is starting to get very you know boring but you know Alright, on that note guys, I'm going to end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope that the advice I gave were useful and resourceful. And uh, let me know if you guys want to see more of those types of videos um, down below. Make sure you like, comment, share and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.